Hi, good morning everyone. How are you today? I hope everyone is healthy and well. Now we are going to read aloud. The title of this story is If You Take a Mouse to School by Laura Numerov, illustrated by Felicia Bond. Are you ready, students? Here we go! If you take a mouse to school, he'll ask you for your lunch. When you give him your lunch box, he'll want a sandwich and a snack for later. Then he'll need a notebook and some pencils. He'll probably want to share your backpack too. When you get to school, he'll put these things in your locker and take a look around. He might do a little math and spell a word or two. He'll even try a science experiment. Then, he'll need to wash up. You'll have to take him to the bathroom. Once he's nice and clean, he'll be ready for his lunch. On the way to the lunch room, he'll see some building blocks. He'll build a little mouse house and make some furniture out of clay. Then, he'll need some books for his bookshelf. He'll start by writing one of his own. So, he'll need a lot of paper. He probably used up all your pencils. When he's finished, He'll want to read his book to you. Then he'll want to take it home. So he'll put it on your lunchbox and pack it in a safe place. When the bell rings, he'll run out to wait for the bus. While he's waiting, he'll play a quick game of soccer. Then, he'll ask you to shoot a few baskets and do a little skateboarding. When he stops to catch his breath, he'll want to eat his neck. So, he'll ask you for your lunchbox and chances are if he asks you for your lunchbox. You'll have to take him back to school. Now, it's your turn to answer the questions. Number one, what is the title of this story? Number two, who is the illustrator of this story? Number three, what did the mouse do in the school number four what did the mouse do while he was waiting for the bus and don't forget to submit your answer through google classroom see you next week in the english literacy bye bye